O-rings are one of the most common types of seal on the planet. They are used in almost everything from the plumbing in your home to cars, industrial machinery and even rockets. Knowing the size of O-ring you need is extremely important, otherwise it won't seal correctly and could cause leaks or even damage to equipment. Ideally, it is best to refer to any user manuals to find the exact size you need, but if this is not possible, you can measure the old one as long as it isn't stretched or damaged. It is best to use an O-ring measuring tool, but it can be done by using a ruler, or even better, some calipers. First, lay the O-ring on a flat surface and measure the inner dimension with the ruler. Then, using the ruler or calipers, measure the cross section, but be careful not to squeeze the rubber as this will give you an incorrect measurement. Once you have these two measurements, you can easily find the O-ring you need, because as standard, sizes are displayed in the format of inner dimension by cross section. In some cases, it is important to know the outer dimension of an O-ring. To find this, you simply add the inner dimension to 2 times the cross section. So in the case of the 10 by 2, it would be 10 plus 2 plus 2, giving an outer dimension of 14 millimeters. These guidelines should help you find the size you need, but there are hundreds of uses for O-rings. So if you are still unsure or if you don't have the old O-ring, please get in touch and we'll be happy to help you.